Hello. You have a reputation for being nice. Are you happy with that? Yes, um, you know, I try to be a good person on and off the court. For sure, when you step on the court, you're, uh, you put your game face on and uh, you want to play your best and fight for each point. And off the court, you know, you just got to be, the, you know, yourself. You got to be nice and not uh, think you're superior and put others inferior. You know, we see that a lot in uh, every day. So, uh, how often do you meet someone who is disappointed? when they realize you are not Caroline Wozniacki. <laughs> we get, um, yeah, we got mixed up pretty a lot of times and uh, I receive her faxes under my door sometimes or sometimes they give her my court and I get her court. Well, now it's pretty much, I think, uh, they know who's uh, Caroline Wozniacki and Alexandra Wozniacki. If you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Oh, that's a tough one. I love Polish food, so for sure like pierogies and uh, different soups or meat dishes, um, it's tough. Or chocolate. <laughs> but then I would need to be running everywhere. <laughs> Tell us about your greatest victory. Uh, I had 2008-2009, my first big title on the WTA Sony Ericsson Tour. I won in Stanford. Um, it was a big win for me. I beat a couple of players in the top 10. I won against Serena Williams. Um, Samantha Stasser, your favorite Aussie. Um, Marion Bartoli had a great tournament there. I was the first woman from uh, Quebec to be uh, in the top 50. Share with us a childhood memory. When I was little, my first tournament that I've been to, and I was back like four years old, five, like flashbacks, and um, that year was the guys' tournament. So I remember I was so excited to get Patrick Rafter in the autograph and all that. And uh, yeah, he was, you know, good looking dude. <laughs> and, uh, you know, all the girls are after him, but he played really great. How important is it to be number one? Well, I think I would let Caroline Wozniacki answer that question. <laughs> I'm still not there, but um, I think, um, yeah, it's a dream for every girl to be number one in the world. But for me, it's just a number. I mean, uh, for me, my dream is to win a Grand Slam. So I'm really you know, trying to focus on that. Thank you.